Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 1519, where we have 40 moves to clear out 50 frosting, 20 chocolate, and 15 licorice. Okay, so I see the problem here. It's going to be hard to let the, the chocolate grow enough while we're trying to take out everything else. Um, let's see. Well, we just need to take out as much frosting as we can, right? because then we'll complete this order and we'll have access to the licorice we need. And if we can avoid the chocolate for a bit, then maybe we can get that order filled first. Sometimes we won't be able to take or uh, ignore the chocolate. We'll have to take something out, and that's okay too. Let's see. We don't want the chocolate actually getting too much of a stronghold. Okay, so now we can take out some of the licorice as well. And the licorice is like the frosting. If I take out licorice, no new licorice uh, will come down on that next turn. So I have to be a bit careful about that. But now that I've got things going and I still have 26 moves, um, it's not as worrisome to me as it might otherwise be. Huh. Still have to get the frosting. Alright, so now I probably do want to start taking out some chocolate. And then I'll let it grow again. Kind of have to do this back and forth. But if I don't take out the chocolate, I don't have room to make these moves that are going to take out this frosting. Oh, nice. Purple looks good. Let's take out purple. Concentrate the colors down. Without purple, there's more matches and specials that can be created. All right, uh, we have all the frosting we need. So now it is just a matter of the chocolate and the licorice. So I do need to try to let things grow. Let's see. Oh, I'm going to do this. Bust through one more big time to clear out as much space as possible so I can work along the borders and ignore the chocolate. But it looks like I shouldn't have any trouble getting this done. So we get that to come down here. If I don't take out a licorice, I'll get more licorice to drop down. Again, if I don't take out a licorice, I'll get more licorice to drop down. I now have all the chocolate I need on the board and all the licorice I need on the board. So now it kind of doesn't matter what I take out. There we go. Well, that was okay. I still have five moves left. You can't really end a level like this where you have chocolate and licorice to collect too much sooner uh, than toward the end. And um, that was my first playthrough for recording purposes, so I think that worked out okay for me. If you'd like to see more videos, you can subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, especially about how the chocolate or the licorice works, if this is all new to you, let me know in the comment section. I can explain things further. And as always, thanks for watching.